Hello friends, Jason Kiefer here, Park City Medical Center chef. Uh, New Year's coming around, 2010's coming to an end. I know that you all have these great questions for me in regard to how we're going to keep our diets in line for 2011. Some great recipes that you might be wanting to see. Well, I've got one for today that's going to be wonderful. Come follow me and we'll put this together. Today we're going to prepare a wonderful ahi tuna. Uh, we're going to do an orange for the holiday season, an orange coriander crusted ahi tuna. We're going to serve it with the butternut squash, which is in season right now. Uh, we're going to finish with some baby spinach and uh, sauteed garlic, and then we're going to do a light vinaigrette that's going to accompany the dish. Very nice light on the, uh, the simulation factor of the body. It's going to be a sesame oil, a tamari soy, so we're going to take the wheat out, which will keep the gluten out of this dish. Um, as well as the pomegranate, which is one of these great antioxidants that you've been hearing about now for, what, a good two, three years. Um, so let's put this dish together. I've got my pan going right here. I've got some oil here, and it's a, it's a wonderful oil that we already put together. It's an orange infused, so we took some orange zest, orange coriander, and we steeped that into this oil so it comes out with that fragrant smell of the fish. I'm probably gonna go about one minute on each side, then we're gonna finish it there. At the end, we've got some beautiful orange zest that's going to contrast the colors and flavors in the dish. We will sprinkle a little bit more coriander, kind of bring out that aromatic uh, holiday spice for us. Nice thing about this dish is once your, once your butternut squash are previously steamed, they're cooled down, we can finish everything in this one particular pan. So there's no big messes that we have to worry about. Put some of that in there. And that's just a quick reheat. So all we're trying to do is bring out the temperature of this again. You see, we don't want to bring too much color because we want to keep all that beautiful orange in there. I'm going to season that with the sea salt. We've got some wonderful cut chives here. And then, pop that there. So, basically now that's done. I've got the spinach. And the spinach is just going to be a quick, quick uh, flash on this. It's just going to cook down very quickly. I've got a little bit of the apple cider vinegar here that I'm going to use. that down like so. Let's put the spinach in there. We take our butternut squash put there. You'll see the portions are very small in here. Again, typically uh, what we want us to do is produce food that's, you know, no more than, more than four ounces in protein, another three ounces in the carbohydrates, and the oils are very minimum here. So, that, the fish here, pop up like that. And this is the fun finishing touch. We're going to actually derive a very quick vinaigrette. We've got the pomegranate that I told you about, all the antioxidants there. So that's going to be beautiful. We're going to put that in there. It's going to bring some color to the plate. We've got some already previously toasted pine nuts. So we'll put that there. Our orange zest, color, some chives. Okay. Now, I used uh, a soy sauce here, but it's a soy sauce that doesn't have the wheat in it, as I shared with you. It's called tamari. It's a Japanese soy. So we'll just add a little bit of that. We've got an apple cider vinegar, which again is going to help digestion. And we always add a little bit of the fat, and this is our coriander orange. And this is just going to be kind of slightly whisked up like so. I'm not going to add any salt to this because there's already there's a lot of sodium in that tamari. And now, what we're going to do is we're going to just drizzle this around the plate. So, let those pomegranates fall. You see it's just really coming to life with all those beautiful holiday colors. Um, if we choose at this point, we could add a little bit more of the orange around here and some more chives. And there you have it. It's beautiful uh, coriander and orange crusted ahi tuna, roasted butternut squash, baby spinach with slight garlic essence, toasted pine nut, and pomegranate vinaigrette. So I hope you enjoyed the dish here. Uh, you know, it was a pleasure of mine to kind of showcase some of the great gluten-free ideas that we've discovered here at Park City uh, Medical Center. In fact, uh, I've got a great, great, wonderful thing that we're going to introduce come January. We thought that wouldn't it be wonderful to introduce a gluten-free class, especially with all these different issues that are taking place nowadays with gluten intolerances. Uh, some of you might have uh, issues with digesting your food. Some of you might just want more information of really what gluten-free cooking is all about. So. What we've decided is January 11th, 2011, we're actually going to showcase a wonderful program here called Gluten Free for You and Me. So please join me and our dietitian, Liz Bynan, on January 11th, 2011. If you need more information, you can look at facebook.com, be under the Park City Medical Center. And uh, I look forward to seeing you all there.